in the paint booth. Now what I got here, I've already went ahead. I see here's. Can you see that right here? What my hand is? Look. Okay, that's the three skull heads. Can you see the three, three skull? Three skull heads or three dumb nuts? <laughs> Actually, it's the Three Stooges, okay? <laughs> there you go. That's their gravestone. Uh, okay, then we got, of course, you know, Hot Rods USA, okay? Number one. So what I got to do, I've already put the base coat on, and you come over here, see on this one, this one's made in red, so I want to hit the base coat in red. And this is our Hot Rod Alley, see? It says Hot Rod Alley. It's got the flames on it and the checkered flags. Okay. Now what I gotta do is I gotta come back and I'll start all the way down at the end because my exhaust fans are here, see, so it's gonna suck the paint this way. There you go. And then that way I'll move. But here's my this is our production line paint table right here. See, this is how it's all done. This is it. It looks like carbon can pieces. No, we ain't worried about that. But this is how it's done right here. See, there it is. That's the famous art brush table. So yeah, you look like Let a me. wild man. Your hair is all, all right. crazy. Your face is all black. That's, that's cause I fucking work for a living, okay? Oh, yeah. I fucking work. I don't sit around looking pretty like you, okay? Oh, oh. So, let me go ahead and get these painted. Well, let's get I'm out of here, I'm gonna set man. the camera over here in the corner so you can watch me paint the... Actually, I got some footage of me painting already. I'll throw that in there so you can see how it's all done. Cause I like going to paint the big cars shows. I'll throw that in there so you can see how it's all done. Cause I like going to the big car show and... Can you finish that out? Where am I, I going? Was Where at? Three, four, five, Tupelo. Eight. Am I going to Tupelo, Mississippi? No, Biloxi. We're going to Biloxi, Mississippi, to the big car show. Bruno doesn't like to be held like Thank that. Thank God, you're not leaving tomorrow, are you? So we're going to go to Biloxi, Mississippi, to cruise in the coast. There's going to be fifty thousand registered cars there. Oh, there's not. Yeah, there is. Look on the internet. www.cruisingthecoast.com. I will be there, Pete. In person. Go Love by and see. Say hey. Okay, come get one of my uh, work shirts. See? Oh, yeah. We're going to be selling Only work, $10. Shirts. work shirts. Work shirts. Only $10. I got three beautiful designs. This is my favorite one, of course. Okay, Minnie has put her heart and soul in making the shirt. She is the t shirt maker. Yes, okay? I am. I hope she does a better job on the one she just made where the ink doesn't come off like the last it. one she made. Fire. Fire. Okay, Bruno, are you ready? You ready for me to paint? Because I gotta get to work, bud. Right. Mama's gotta feed you. See you later. Manny's gotta get back to work. Come on, baby. We'll see you later.
called Production Line Metal Art 101 in progress. Now this type of airbrushing, it's artistic, yes. It's cartoonish, yes. And it's abstract, yes. Okay, but that's not really what this is all about. What this is about is starting something from scratch and finishing it. Now, there's our rat. And you see how I've detailed it. Okay, no, this is not fucking, uh, you know, high tech, uh, not multi million dollar airbrushing. This is a type of artistic airbrushing that there are so many other kinds, this is one of them, okay? Now I still have to clear coat this, but I will be using a very, very semi-clear, almost flat, because we don't want reflections of high gloss getting in the way of the shadows of our artwork. So, that's what it looks like, okay? All my little rat buddies here. Bam, bam, bam. Whoa, whoa, easy, bud. Bam, bam. And let's not forget the other side. Right here. Bam, 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 and boom. Now, there you go. I mean, uh, how much easier can it be, you know? We used a total, to make that, we used a total of one, two, three, four, we used a total of five colors, get that out. That's the paint that we used, okay, to make our rat rods. Now of course I use base coat, clear coat paint, and uh, there's my airbrush right here. This is a very universal great airbrush to use. This is a Crescenda. It's called a Badger Crescenda. You can pick that up at MJ Designs or any art supply. And I'm trying to see if I can see the name on it, but I can't. So, But it's made by Badger. It's called a Crescenda. I still can't read it. Well, I'm the only one here this early in the morning, so I got to film myself. And uh, now I got to paint these behind me, as you see right here. Okay, and there you go, that's it. I mean, uh, you know, have fun, do what you want to do, enjoy what you do, take your time, do it right, and don't let anybody stick it in your fucking ass, because if that happens, okay, I might need that rat to pull the fucking stick out of my ass. Take it easy, this is Pete, Southwest Rod and Custom, Louisville, Texas, suburb of Dallas, Take it easy. We'll see you at the big car show, cruising the coast, 5,000 registered cars, be at the swap meet. Thank you.